Hello and welcome my name is Mentorius and welcome back to Satisfactory. If we're looking to this beautiful tree and my station hub, you might notice something is missing. And when we started at this location, it looked kind of perfect, but well, where are the miners? Well, I thought something that this wasn't the most perfect spot to start. So if we take a look back, I found two iron ores locations way closer to the other stuff and I started to move the factory. And well, let me show you around. I set up the basic, I moved everything around. And well, I kind of connected one iron or section and started let me get up there sometimes procure is my best knowledge and well I kind of built up a basic assembly line and this smoke isn't the best spot to take a look at it but well now you can see it is a simple setup making two uh, lines of iron rods and two lines of iron plates. I also connected the uh, iron, no, the copper mine and the, uh, the limestone. So we are now at a phase that we kind of need to move control or also known as the hut and I think this is the perfect spot so let's take a look at my inventory it's kind of full so for the movement of our main hut we need to uh, make a little box I thought I had a little box can I make a box no I cannot make it yet oh my god this is going to be horrible but well I do need to move it we are going to move our main hut to that section and well I also connected uh, or made two tiers so I made the uh, tier that can make the splitters is also known in the tier one and I made the, the one that makes the chainsaw so this is what happens when you destroy the hut and well it comes back in this little box and uh, let me destroy this as well i'm going to destroy that workstation as well we can dismantle it now because we're not going to need it anytime soon no boxes that's a good thing and everybody everything should shut down perfectly nice all right so we've set up the basic of factory and i might even make it a tree line factory but for now this will do and the reason i set it up this way be, is because well it is kind of perfect as you can see it's it's symmetrical it's it's perfect for people with ocdc and uh, well you got a lot of resources i'm not quite sure where we're going to build the store Port, but I guess in this episode we are going to focus on the copper line kind of building something like this and I think it's going to go on that side or maybe we could even make a new floor to bring the copper in I guess we're going to do that well we got a lot of things we could do but for now I want to place the hut because we need to that's the only oh I need to remove this power pole for that. Thank you. And it's gone. Perfect. Now we got a space and we got room. And let's equip it. So you can move your heart anytime you want. And then you can build it by just special project hut. And the only thing you need is that little square box. So don't destroy it, don't lose it. And as you can see, you get all the question marks back. Those are kind of annoying. But well, I have to look at everything again. Oh yeah, I didn't notice that before. And we need to go back inside. Oh, I can sleep? No. Oh yeah, uh, I was equipping the 
power. So I need to set the power back on. And I guess that's something we are going to need for this episode as well. But I don't think we'll be capable of doing that in this episode. It is setting up a bio power fuel station, something like that. All right. Come on. Yes, you can go across that section. All right, now the only thing we need to do is put in my biofuel. And as you can see, we are running on biofuel now. I can make that by hand, but well, maybe we'll do that differently in the future. And we also buy, unlock the MAM. The MAM is unlocked when you go to tier two. And it's, it's kind of like a research area, but well, it gets your personal stage, personal storage boxes and that kind of stuff. So let's check it out. Let's check it out. What do you want me to research? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Confirm. What do you want me? I can... Uh... Alright. So, we are able to analyze stuff and we get stuff back for that. So... Now with everything uh, moved, uh, we need to set up a plan for the copper line. And well, not quite sure if we are going to put it in this section. Oh, out of. And all right, we got ourselves a foundation. Now let's see if I can get back up again, because that's the biggest problem, getting it back up. All right, so my copper lines comes in here. And well, yeah, what are we going to do? I need to have a lookup point. What's that? Something caught my eyes. Why aren't you guys working? Because you should be working. No power? How can that be possible? Oh, I did turn the power on. Oh, my big mistake. No, I did put the power on. So, why isn't the power working? You're connected to the B line. The B line is connected to the C line. Oh, but the lines aren't connected to these two. And as you can see, we're immediately having power issues. And wait, you can see my capacity, it's not that much anymore. So I really need <laughs> to get to do something with the power. And well, I'm not quite sure where to put it. I kind of need a lookout point. Do I kind of build that point already? Because that would be nice. No, I cannot. Power lines, a biomass burner. I guess we uh, we we'll, we first need the copper. We'll definitely need the copper. And I guess we are going to start building walls and entrances to the factory. I guess this is going to be an entrance. Yeah, this does look like a nice entrance place. And as you can see, I kind of want to make it this color because it's the only one that got the big gate and I kind of like the big gate it, it's perfect it, it's and I wonder if it, yeah as you can see these sides almost look identical I wonder what the end this is I guess this is the outside yes that's the outside well it's debate you can bait on that but I think it's the outs outside wall all right now let's start building the factory we got a little worker spot here I think we need to move this but we'll see that in a few seconds uh, let's build wall let's build I really think that's debatable and I'm not sure if well I guess we are going to do it that way and all right let's build the factory up 
going to use a lot of cement for that. Lucky I got a cement line. But I'm already out. So let's build the cement, or the cement is being processed, and I got plenty of that. All right, let's get into this factory. Let's make a gate here. What? What just happened? We can be out of power already. Oh, we spiked over it. Yeah, we're definitely having a power issue. All right, so how are we going to fix that power issue? This one, this power line is a full. Uh, so I am going to put another one next to this one. I'm going to destruct that one. And we're going to destroy that one. These two are going to be connected to each other. And I'm going to build another one because that's kind of the line for my biomass burners. And uh, this, this doesn't look nice, but well, it's temporary. Because as soon as we go to coal, it will... Yeah, 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 I know you're having trouble. But, well, I need to have some bio, bio burners to kick up the power a little bit more. I wasn't expecting to do this right away, but, well... I guess I need it. Uh, I only got five fuel left, so I guess the next thing we're going to do is chop down some wood. And make ourselves some bio burners. Alright, we got a little spare spot. I always wonder if I could take down a big tree. So I'm not going to take down the big tree that I'm starting with. Oh great, I have no biofuel, so I cannot chop any trees down at all. Let's first make our biofuel. Got my working spot. And biomass. I guess 10 leaves isn't going to cut it. It's definitely not going to cut it. Uh, let's get some more leaves and <laughs> let's start it. making biofuel. All right, so we got some leaves. I definitely need to set up some kind of biofuel product system because this isn't how I like to have it. All right, we can make some biofuel now. We can make uh, some of these and we're going to cut down trees with this. And I guess these trees are first to go. I made myself a big, big chainsaw. Yeah, we're going to chop down some trees. We are going to be horrible to nature. And it's getting us only 15 wood. That not much. Alright, I am wondering if the big tree is giving us way more. And we're going to see if that's... How the game works. Bigger trees get more wood. They should. And well, I guess we're going to that big tree over there. Get some nuts. Gonna chop down this tree as well. And walk all the way up there and take down that big tree. See if it works. If that's how they want it. Oh man, this is one amazing tree. And I guess we can chop it down. I wonder how much... That That's kind of disappointing. 28 woods for such a big, beautiful tree. That's definitely disappointing. Yep. And there goes my power again.
And this little tree only gives me three. Alright, any parts I left here the last time I was here because I already saw this part. Need to open. Ooh! Repair needed. Alright, I need some copper cable to open it. I didn't even notice that, that I could open that stuff. Ooh, I got the cable. Can I now repair or open it? Because that would be cool. No, that's not what we need. I guess it's rotators. Yeah, I need rotators. And I don't have those. I don't have those yet. So, I guess we cannot open this. Computer, pick up the computer. Or anything else? Alright, let's take down one more tree. And then we should be able to make a lot of biofuel. We're going to walk our way back, take down some more trees on the way back because we got 15 biofuel left and we can chop down a lot of trees with that. Look at that nice red glow in there. Oh man, you scared the hell out of me. I thought it was an animal or something like that. But I do know there are some pretty roaming animals in the desert. Well, I guess that tree has to go as well. No, we're not going to chop down the first tree. No, no, no. I have my principle. I'm not going to do that. Maybe? Little? No, no, no. We're not going to do that. We got a whole forest down there, so we can chop that down if we need to. All right, that was a lot of wood. You can see we got a lot of trees down there, so I guess we are going to clear this all because in the end, this is all going to be factory anyway. So I'm going to make the factory like uh, four high because I want to have my walkway across the section that way we can look over the factories and I like to look over my factories but for now we have to do with the power no I don't want to make a pole why would I make a pole so the first thing we need to do is make that factory four high and well that's our main mission for now uh, no, our main mission is now biofuel. And we're going to make some leaves. You don't have enough space. What's this then? Silica. Alright, interesting. Uh, I guess I'm going to drop some stuff in my locker. Yeah, my personal locker here, over there. What are we going to drop when we... No, no, we need one. I guess we don't need the high-tech stuff at the moment. It's kind of waste of space of slots. Yeah, we don't need that. All right. Now we got the space. Uh, when we upgrade some tiers, we get more inventory slots. And, oh man, this, the only annoying thing is you cannot uh, holster your your chainsaw and that's get getting quite annoying once you oh we can make a lot of biofuel from the wood look at that if only 100 this is amazing we can make a lot of biofuel with this all right this is what i like All right, we are definitely making a lot of biofuel now. We should be able to run the factory for a while on this. Uh, make more biofuel. And it's, it's pretty fast making it this way. I was thinking of making some kind of working, some kind of belt construction to just make biofuel, but well, Kind of feels like a waste doing it. Uh, because as you can see, this goes quite fast. This goes pretty fast. 
and more biofuel. And once we get this running, it will take some time before it is well out of biofuel. So I hope by that time we should have been able to build the factory up and running. All right, we got 200. Two times 200 biofuel, what's this? Biomass, so I still have biomass. Guess that wooden biomass. But we cannot make anything from that, all right. Let's go to our power distributor. I guess this is the only one that's out of fuel, so let's put 200 in that. And we are going to start constructing again all right it needs to be four high and i want to have one more line so i guess this is going to be the first factory hall and then i want to have two sections in between and then <laughs> well that's going to be the copper section, I guess. All right, let's let just start with the copper factory sections, and I will build the factory walls in between. So this is kind of the way up uh, inside the factory, and I hope you can all bear with me how it's going to look. Well, that one has to come later on once we made the belts a little bit better. Because that one is also going into the copper factory. In the end, I want to have one belt. Well, kind of go across the factory or something like that. Well, I could try that. I have something in my mind. All right, let's let's see if that's going to work. What's in my mind? Let's see if we can get it out. Because that, this is going to be interesting. I guess is this going to be the one? Yes, that's the one. Because I was thinking uh, we can make the copper belt go through the factory from one side to the other side. Uh, what we are going to need for that? Oh, we cannot make that yet. But I'm ah man, what do we need for that? Let's see. Let's see. Uh, I need to unlock some stuff. I need to unlock this one. Oh man. Well, I'm first going to set up the copper section. And... For now, the limestone section. Oh no, I want to make it perfect. Oh man, well... I'm going to set up a worker temporary to get this all up and going. I know I don't want that on my right side. I just want to make a worker. It's kind of annoying that it, it's... Well, let's put it... No, are you not going to be able to make it? Oh, I'm not able to afford it. Oh, that that's a whole different ball game. That's a whole different ball game. Uh, we need reinforced plate. We need screws for that one. Oh, we got plenty of screws. All right, well, let's make reinforced plates. All right, now we can make the worker. And it needs to go that way. Thank you. All right, now I only need to have some power on this baby. And this will do for now. And I want you to make copper wire because I need it. I kind of need more space in my inventory. 
Oh, we're going to drop some more stuff. Uh, where's the aluminium dead? I don't need that. I definitely don't need yet. Well, we could use and research more of that stuff. <coughs> my apologies, my voice is go. You're going to talk now? Right, you can have your extra analysis and I'm not quite sure how that fits the story that this this because I get some extra stuff from it but well it's 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 I'm not quite sure how that works so we're going to select the conveyor belt uh, set the milestone and I'm going to get all the resources I need in the end I want to have that also in the factory but we'll do that later on and well i would have a conveyor belt going up here but well oh man i have so much stuff in my head and i kind of want to show you by building it but it's i also want to explain it and that that's that's the fun part because it's all in my brain it's it's definitely in my brain uh, what were we supposed to make? Oh yeah, we were supposed to get 100 copper plate and 100 iron rods. Well, I already have the copper plates, I guess. No, we don't have that anymore. What's this? Wood. Oh, that's wood. Yeah, I knew that, that it was wood. Well, I need 100 copper plates. And the other one is uh, totally on the other side of the factory. We need to walk all the way over there. And we should have a pretty big storage section now and once we need more well i kind of want to i'm not quite sure if we're going to put the splitter in here so but i need to find a way to improve this because there's a lot going in here and it's 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 perfectly splitting it but that way these guys have a quite large stock and as do these so well you only need more more uh one more row i guess we can make two or two more rows extra rows here in this page because this is one two three blocks one two three well i guess not i guess we can only fit one more row in it but in the end we can always go up we can always go up uh yes i'm talking way too much i need to keep my brain glued to this project uh no that uh, now let's see how much how fast this thing is because ooh, it's pretty fast didn't expect that and uh, i guess we're going to steal a few copper bars and we're going to make the last part ourselves uh, 150 ding 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 this is going pretty fast all right and we got everything we need all right push the last button come on push it push why can i push it oh yes thank you and we have unlocked the conveyor belt walls Now I think I have a little problem because that thing is in the way. Well, we'll look at that when we get to that. Uh, for for up. So now we got the walls with the conveyor belts, and we are going to. I know I'm going to make it in gold. Everything going to going to be in gold. Yes, that's the one and we are going to build kind of the same on this side hmm. could make it lower yes we're going to make it lower and the wall isn't falling down that that that's kind of scary kind of wonder which side yeah Yes, that's the one. Still wonder. Yeah, that look good. 
All right. So the next factory entrance is going to be this section. Let's make ourselves. What's the outside? This is the. I think I already made that wrong, but. Yeah, it's good. All right, it's good. So, um, oh no, that's one too much. I'm already seeing one more problem, but we'll get to that once we get to that. Uh, two height, yes. All right, that's all done and done. Now let's see if it's going to work just like I wanted it to go. Yes, it does. Oh man, this is going to be great. Now I need to reroute everything because we got two conveyor belts over here. And the first one is going to get a quick turn. I'm not quite sure if this is going to work. No, it's not. It's too close. So if you're wondering how to get those poles up, I've been wondering myself for a long time. But you kind of press the mouse button, then the next turn you can move your mouse up and then you can set the height I guess it needs to get go a little bit further was expecting it to go well we could do that because in the end it this is all going to be yes it, it this is all going to be kind of going that way but maybe that way we can make this do what we want yes perfectly now the next one is going to go up as well oh man we're never going to get this finished before the end of the episode uh. So I'm going to work a little bit and I'll be right back with you because I want to have this finished at the end of this episode. So I've been building a lot but I'm running at some concrete problems so I'm first going to build one line of concrete. I brought the two belts, well they're kind of going through the factory now, That's that looks kind of cool as you can see. We got the iron ore on this belt and the limestone on that belt. And you can walk from factory hall one to factory hall two. I really want them to put be able to put names in it because that would be kind of cool. And I'm going to need a lot of cement. So we're going to build a worker or a constructor. I keep calling them workers. I don't know where I get that from, but well, it's in my brain and you can't get it out. Like some people call the animal, give the animals names. I don't do that. Now, let's see if we can get the angle down to this one. No, I was already expecting that that wouldn't work. But I want to keep it kind of neat and clean. So I guess we're going to build two more. I can't afford it. Ah. All right, all right. Well, let's see how far we can get that constructor out that way. We can get it all the way over there. This angle should be possible. And as you can see, I already placed a power pole over here. 
And I'm kind of going to cheat a little bit because they haven't made anything beautiful in this game to get the power of poles from one building to the next building. So what we are going to do, I got the power poles up and the next thing I'm kind of going to do, oh, I was expecting, oh I'm just out of cement. Right, let's get the cement power up just. This is one big factory line. And the copper doesn't need to be as big as the iron ore. Well, not quite sure about that one. But for now, I kind of want to make the factory halls. Two factory halls, the same side with copper and copper cable. That way, oh yeah, I do need to give it an order. I want you to make, uh, no, I don't want you to make this. I want you to make cement, concrete. All right, this one will work. And I want to show you one more thing, but I need some concrete to do that. <laughs> one more, come on, come on, 67 trend, thank you. All right, so as you can see, uh, we could do wall like this and that way the cable goes through but it, it's not beautiful and I kind of want them to have a wall where you can get the power go through so I'm doing it the cheesy way it, it still isn't beautiful but well it will get me to factory walls and that's kind of what I want so this is going to be the factory hall one and this is going to be factory hall two. Factory hall two is going to have the cement, the copper, but it will take me some time and maybe in the end uh, some secondary stuff. But I kind of want to have the secondary stuff like the screws and that stuff on the second floor. And that then in the end we need to put the this thing way up in the factory. So what can we do? Can we do anything? Yes, we can. Oh, then we are definitely going to do something. Send something up to space. And some copper cables. First that one, that one. And all right. This is a perfect way to end an episode. Press the red button. Press another milestone. And well, we got these. We got some upgrades. Color gun, we don't need that one. So the only one I need for the factory is is the walkways. And after that, we definitely need to go to tier three and get the coal up and running. But we need space elevator, and I need to think how I'm going to build the space elevator because before I'm going to build the space elevator, well, I kind of want to get factory three or factory hall one and two roofed up uh, but we're a long way from that because we need a lot of raw materials for that one so i hope you guys all enjoyed this episode i definitely did and if you do press the subscribe button we are going to push out these videos two times a week on thursday and on saturday and on the tuesday we are going to do stone hard and also check me out at the stream. I'm doing a factory build with WT. And also check out his uh, channel. Uh, the stream is going to be on Twitch. So push the follow button is in the comment down below or in the description. Man, I'm totally losing my mind. So I'm going to quit. And hope to see you all in the next video. Where I kind of want to have this factory built. I want to show you, so I'm going to build some walls in between. That's not the interesting part. The interesting part is the part where I show you how it looks when it's all done. So, see you all at the next Satisfactory.